okay hello friends in my previous video i have explained how to create and uh, create mysql table and how to run how to input how to list how to show the databases and tables everything now in this video i am explaining about how to import mysql database okay before that it is okay Bef before begin to spoke first of all you must start okay first of all hadoop it is mandatory first check hadoop is running or not yes it's running okay okay hadoop is started everything is fine so now i want to import all tables from this is syntax uh, basically if you want to import tables from the you know database all tables then simply run this command by default it store it did store here it is running map to job and uh, running job in case if you if you are exporting a lot of data it's running map to your job now uh, it's take a lot of time so be patient now map will complete within couple of minutes and then reduce will start yes map completed we just started okay now four records so it is four record is nothing but the uh, help with this department table now I'm get beginning import of employment. This is employment. You can check it. Okay. So if you have a huge lot of tables, it take a lot of time. Be patient. Okay. This is beginning of importing employee tables in employment employee table around 14 records. Okay. No, oh, sorry. You know, if you want to check it out, okay, you do FS LS. Mm. This is user. Um, so you see here, user by default it is storing here. My pass username is password. Hadoop. So it is storing here. This is department table and employee table so successfully you have imported some databases from sorry some uh, all tables from these tables okay i hope you understand um, mm, now what next uh, if you want to check if you want to see this uh, cat hello EMP that PART. Uh, I hope this is the command to show the list of tables. Okay, this is list of tables. You can check them. You can check here directly. This is my SQL. This is employee name, name Smith, clerk. Same information but it is sub by default it is a uh, separated by comma okay alin yes alin what jeans so almost every data it is stored here all data if you run this command you can export you can import all data but i don't want all data then i want to get only a particular data then what should you do simple uh, next i want to import enter database
uh, otherwise my sql i want to import all database sorry all tables entire database i want to import okay this is the command i have already i will let you know um, in my sql Uh, in venu is a database and uh, now i am importing all the tables entire database from mysql then what should i do simply run this command go to our table take a little time the main business my sql will has a lot of tables oh sorry something wrong if you get this error first of all you oh something syntax different oh uh, actually if you want to export all tables this is a command Oh, sorry. I need to import this one. I need to import. Uh, you must include this one. That means, if you mistakenly, in a, if you make a mistake, automatically it suggests. If you to import all tables, you must include this one. I have already run this command. Okay, in this in this syntax, it is different. Table name. TMP. That means, basically. Uh, basically in venue table i want to oh sorry okay in this is mysql table hmm so i want to know which and let example uh, show Show tables in my SQL. Okay. Let example. I want to import only user table. Then what should I do? Simple. In now import my my SQL database and table is user. Okay. Now I will get only this one here m1 is nothing but mapper one only okay oh, uh, table u s e r okay okay now you can then minimize this one it's not take much time just it's a select star from user okay you are importing only one table so it's a bit time not too much mm, five four three two one that means internally it's run map reduce okay running mapper then reducer beginning importing of user table yes it's only to record okay by default everything it is stored here i do you can check it out ls okay just now this is your table okay in user table is running map reduce job that's why it is success and you will get map partition that's why to run PART tab if you run this one now you will get this information that means what data within this table 
okay you don't ask what this data etc it's by default available okay now okay now successfully i have imported a entire data or uh, a particular table okay and what next import connect and pet table split by name okay sometimes okay fine and okay one more i want to i don't want to store here let example i don't want to store here i want to store a particular folder then what should you do simple for example where is this my sql i want user table i want to store somewhere a particular folder then run target give directory you can mention anything sq of scoop that's it automatically this data is stored in this table basically as of now there is no any scoop folder now automatically create the folder and dump this data into a particular folder okay and then this one same command running map to job to record on okay you can check ls if you run this one automatically new table is scope oh, sorry new folder now within scope i hope you we are using both success and map if you want to hmm these two records same information okay uh, this is a particular folder what is this this one okay okay fine uh, in my next video how to i am explaining about how to import but based on where condition that means i want to import only particular thank you thank you and uh, if you like this video and uh, comment uh, please share through online and uh, uh, if you have any doubts comments below and if you satisfy this video I request please plant ten near either temples or gardens or schools or whatever it may be. Thank you, thank you very much. Bye bye.